Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Nandito na naman po si Yuri Saito Tulang With Me, Brand Ambassador ng World of Pungsoy and Business Associates. Anong ating pag-aaralan ngayong araw na to? It's all about tips to fungsoy your work space. Ngayon, people who work spend most of their uh, waking hours at the office so it is imperative to have a harmonious work environment. Functioning in a, pro a properly functional ed office makes a world of difference to productivity and interpersonal relationships. It makes your uh, it makes you enjoy coming to work pag maganda ang ating ano ang ating uh, trabaho, di ba? At saka yung workspace natin is maganda. Harmony at the workspace or workplace diffuses bitchiness, reduces politicking, chismis, and minimize gossip. Okay? Things that can cause much unhappiness. Good feng shui in your personal space mismo helps you achieve recognition and prom promotion. Given these benefits, can afford can anyone afford not to ensure their workspace has been properly feng shui ed? Ito na. Watch your back. Watch your back. Watch your back. Anyone wants to harm you will find it easier to uh, to uh, stay ano uh, still hitty creep on you when you are not watching and hit you from behind so it makes sense when feng shui repeatedly warns you to watch your back okay make sure you have good back support here where you sit just like me maganda ang aking upuan it is more ano uh, anong tawag dito higher than my head okay so it makes sense when feng shui repeatedly warns you to watch your back make sure you have good back support where you sit just like me okay now if you are in a desktop desk job ensure the back of your chair is placed so we so there is a solid wall behind you sitting with your back to the door back to the door kunwari ito yung door okay is incredible bad news that is not uh, uh, good but a window directly behind you again you can also it is also bad close such windows with heavy blinds and uh, curtains and display support symbols of career success behind you which is this one this is what is this this is a mountain okay these are the dragon tortoise or the turtle or the painting of a mountain okay get one that does not have water painted into the scenery wag ganon okay ngayon avoid sitting facing a wall facing a wall dami hindi pwede a desk that is placed facing a wall acts as a barrier to your promotion if you cannot move your desk hang a picture of scenery featuring an open field to symbolize your own personal bright wall or hang on image of a phoenix on the wall in front of you to symbolize being faced with many opportunities okay this will help counter the negative effects of facing a wall and will create the cause for you to change desk to one with better feng shui now display a rooster hmm? display a rooster the rooster is the best symbol to use to counter office politics i know chismis if you are constantly dodging underhanded tactics from co-workers display a rooster with a prominent break and comb to peck to peck away to tukain to unwanted politicking another good symbol is to use this jade cicada oy meron ako nyan jade cicada best worn as a bracelet okay now display as a crystal spear to absorb negative energy nothing ensures 
a harmony and more efficiently than crystal spheres. Place six in a various sizes in the space you have con uh, consciously defined as your own. This will ensure your hours spent at work are pleasant and rewarding. Crystal spheres have great and active power in this period of eight. Now we go on avoiding being a confrontational setting arrangement. Position your work desk so you are not directly facing anyone else. Hindi kayo dapat magkaharap. Hindi pwede. It is better to have your back to someone. Kaya lang, kailangan mag back to back na lang kayo. Than to be position facing another person directly. Mag-aaway kayo because facing someone constantly will cause confrontational energies to build up between you and that person. Even if you work for someone and cannot change the layout of the entire office, try, try to ensure that at least your own desk is positioned to avoid this. Ngayon, kunwari nandyan siya, gumanyang ka na lang, okay? O di hindi mo siya kaharap ngayon, ganyan-ganyan ka. O yung ano mo, yung desktop mo, i ano mo, i, i diagonal mo na lang uh, sa table mo para hindi mo siya makaharap, okay? Choose the right chair. Choose the right chair, ha? Huh? The chair you sit it at work will have a bearing on how well you do in your career. So because you have to sit it in for long periods at time of time at a time, especially in a desk desk job, get a chair that is ano uh, ergonomically designed to prevent to prevent back and neck strain. Ah, this allowing you to sit at length without getting tired or uncomfortable. Chairs meant for visitors, on the other hand, do not need to be overly confined, lest that they overstay their welcome. Kailangan ma welcome sila hindi yung ganito ha yung ano lang yung ordinary yung upuan. When picking sofa sets and settees from meeting areas. Go with something not to confide. For that same reason, so harder sofa sets also generates a more dynamic dynamic type of energy, more suit suited to the workplace. Now, do not sit too near to the door. Okay, sitting too near the door, especially the front door in an open plan office, is an unprotected and unprotected and vulnerable location to occupy if the office layout is such that someone has to be nearer than door than others uh, and that someone happens to be to be you uh, try to sit such that you avoid having your back to the door okay make sure make sure you see you can see the door at all times so you have a view of people approaching. Make uh, doubly uh, sure you have the necessary support symbols with you to counter the negative effects of such a desk location. At the next opportunity to move desk, do so. Now tidied up the clutter. A cluttered desk is the surest way to dull your efficiency. Make it a point each morning to spend just 10 minutes clearing your workspace do not let newspapers or books and stationery mess up your space people who say they prefer an organized mess have not enjoyed the toys of tidy desk and will marvel at how efficient they come become they can become if they work in less cluttered manner Ngayon, beware of hidden storage. While you're, you tidy up your desk, it is, it, it is easy to simply shove unwanted documents and papers untidily into drawers and cabinets where they cannot be seen. Although this improves the outward appearance of your desk over time, this can build up into stagnant energy that harms your success at work and scene. 
Do not neglect your drawers and fi filling cabinets. Make it a point to, ev to every now and then go through and organize your drawers. Throw away what you don't need. Itapon lahat. Avoid sharp edges. Okay? Walang sharp edges ang aking ano. Okay lang. So, make sure you, you don't have sharp edges that point directly towards where you sit. Sharp edges are poison arrows that send harmful shy chi or killing energy or killing breath towards you. The killing energy sent your way will not just hamper your career success. It could also cause you fall to ill, get cheated, or get blamed for everything. So, kailangan alamin po natin yan. Work with good lightning. So, ito. A well-designed office is one where lightning is well-designed. Natural lightning is best. So, have as many windows as possible. Marami akong windows. One, two, three, four. O, ba? Diba? So, However, half windows are better than full-length windows for areas where work desks are located. Full-length windows brings in too much young energy. Ano, masyadong ano, uh, uh, anong tawag dito? Masyadong, uh, ano, uh, malakas yung energy, okay? Making it difficult to concentrate kapag sobrang yang ha? and creates a feeling of vulnerability basement wind ano, offices with a few or no windows are seldom auspicious kaya pangit ang underground na opisina to supplemental natural light best is to use full spe spectrum lightning while it si simulates natural daylight brings better visibility buti na lang nandito ako health and efficiency another way to characterize light is to uh, is white versus yellow uh, yellow light white light is better for offices mm, buti na lang because the overly cozy ambience uh, created by yellow light uh, uh, slows down productivity ngayon sit Facing your shenchi, your money luck, your money direction, or your success direction, or your, ah yes, money luck. The best direction to ensure career and business success is to tap your shenchi or your, uh, your uh, wealth direction by sitting facing that, 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 that direction. Finding your shenchi from your kuwa number na naman. Kuha number, kuha number, kuha number. Yung mga hindi alam mag-calculate ng inyong kuha number, then go on, go back to my uh, past videos. Nandyan po ang mga kuha numbers. Okay? By sitting facing that direction, find your senchi from your kuha number using the 8 mansion for formula. If you cannot tap your senchi, try and sit facing one of your other, kasi we have four good direction. One of your other three auspicious direction. It is uh, definitely a must to carry a handy compass. Kailangan may handy compass tayo at all times. So when you attend meetings away from comfort zone from uh, of your desk, you can make it a point to sit facing a good direction. And this will give you an edge when you interact with people. Make this life Ah, uh, make this is a uh, uh, make this a lifelong habit. Ngayon, how to calculate your kuwa number? Ito na kuwa number one, two, three, and four. Sa five ano? Ah, uh, kuwa number one, two, three, four. Para sa sa mga lalaki sa mga male, ang senchi direction ninyo ay para sa kuwa number one southeast, kuwa number two northeast. Kuha number 3, south. Kuha number 4, is north. Para sa mga lalaki. Okay? Para sa mga lalaki, northeast direction. Okay? Northeast direction ang inyong, ano, uh, uh, anong tawag dito? Uh, Shenchi direction. Para sa mga babae naman, kuha number 6, 7, 8, and 9. Pag ikaw ay number 5, 
Ang kuha number mo is southwest. Ay, ang kuha. Ang, ang Shenchi direction mo is southwest. Southwest. So, number 6 is uh, west. Number 7 is northwest. Number 8 is southwest. And number 9 is east. Yan ang inyong, uh, ano, uh, Shenchi direction or lucky direction. Uh, not lucky direction, but it is, ah, uh, money direction, business wealth direction. So, yung mga hindi alam ang mga kuha number, go back to my uh, old uh, uh, video, uh, old uh, videos, you can see the kuha number, how to calculate your kuha number and how can you uh, how can you um, uh, anong tawag dito, papaano ninyo gamitin? How can you use your kuwa number your kuwa number your kuwa good uh, your good direction in your living space okay for may take the last two digits ito na pala for may take the last two digits of your year of birth and add them together keep adding till you get a single number deduct this from 10 if you were born before 2000 and and from 9 for those born in the year 2000 or later, ima-minus nyo ang 9. Okay? Ima-minus nyo ang 9. This gives you your kuwa number. And then for female naman, take the last two digits of your year of birth and add them together. Keep adding till you get a single number. Add 5 to this number if you were born before 2000. Before 2000, 2,000 kayo pinanganak ka and add 6 naman for those born in those year of 2,000 or later if the result is a 2 digit number keep adding till number 1 till get a single number this is your kuwa number for, for example 1963 6 plus 3 is 9 9 plus 5 is uh, 9 plus, plus 5 is uh, 14 Okay, 1 plus 4 is 5. That is my kuwa number. But ay uh, kaya southwest ang aking shenchi direction, ang lak ang aking uh, success direction, okay? Ngayon, eto dito na po nagtatapos ang aking to learn with me about tips to function your workspace. Okay? Ano, uh, sana po marami po kayong natutunan. Please lang po, ano, uh, wag lang po yung ano tayo. Uh, hindi tayo seryoso sa ating pinag-aaralan this is really very advisable po sa atin lalong lalo na kung nag nagtatrabaho po tayo sa isang kumpanya o somewhere na nag-aaral ay nag nagtatrabaho at hindi lang yun kung sarili ninyo ang trabaho ninyo so ano sa mga hindi pa po nakapag-subscribe ano uh, please, please click the button like and share and click the tiny button para ma-notify ma po kayo sa mga upcoming videos ko. Ako po si Yuri Saito na nagsasabing, Hate what is evil and hold on to what is good. Do not let evil defeat you. Instead, instead conquer evil to good. Maraming salamat po sa mga nanonood at ano, uh, nagsusuporta sa akin. Salamat po. Bye-bye. <laughs>